Fighting 2001 is about to begin. Dude, honestly, my account, my my main is actually like, holy fuck. Hold on. Oh, I swear on my main, I've lost like 230 LP or so in the past like week. Like it's just over. 220 LP or 230. It's like, I went from 878 all the way down to fucking 640 or something. Yeah, 645. I had to reclimb. <laughs> Never again. I'm gonna ban, uh... That champion. I I don't like versing a champion that can basically have permanent wave clear and can't be poked out of lane, and then one shot you with two long swords, even if they're O10. That's never fun. I don't think inspiration's good anymore, so I just do whatever. I'm still trying stuff out. I haven't really played. I've, this is probably like my th third cat game this patch, honestly. Maybe you can still go back to resolve, but the most part's gonna be like this or like this. Or this, or this, this, like that. Alright. How do you play Zed against a cat? Just fucking build Hex Drinker. <laughs> Dodge the daggers. Her main damage comes from her daggers, so don't get hit by them. Just learn to walk away from them when they're flying at you, like dropping. And if you have to, alter to dodge the damage from them. There's no way she'll be able to alt and just kill you with her alt. Hex Drinker and Nullifying Orb are probably what you're gonna want in that matchup. Yeah, the worst thing is I can't even jump on her because she will outtrade me really hard. It's just conquer resolve. You not win trades against it no matter what time it is in the game. Yeah, I mean she's dead, but like that's so cancer, what? I got a sword, I dodged that E. Did I not? And flashing there wouldn't have done anything. She would have just flashed after me, if you guys are wondering. If I take like a, a short trade, she actually takes very little damage. Like what is that, dude? I mean now now her Q's on cooldown and all, but like Look at that. She's just gonna be full health again in a couple seconds. Because of corrupting pot. They kinda need to remove it from the game. I remember when I used to be able to run that on Katarina when it was like 150 health, 50 mana. That shit was so fun. Never mind, I'm fucked. That's a tilter. Cause I I should have waited like half a second to flash. Yeah, I I saw my Aurelian soul. Uh, it, it's literally like a coin flip 50-50 If if I be useful or if I go one eight, it's actually a 50-50. Do some fucking stupid dragon quote, like, I am the dragonborn Fusro Da. Yeah, just do some stupid shit. Okay, I'll just lose half my health, I don't care. She might actually go in on me here, that's why uh, Nunu's sitting here. Because the wave is, like, favored for her right now. See, like, I'm somewhat, I'm, like, very far behind in farm right now, because I just can't really walk up. But she wins every single trade. Ooh! Like, she didn't even land her E there, and she still almost killed me. I actually- oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that's just very, very unbalanced. I have to go back. I don't nearly have as much sustain as her, so... She just wins out. Hopefully I can get a roam off and kill their entire team before I really does it. I'm gonna go bot here. This should be a double kill for me, if they don't know I'm walking down. They probably saw me, honestly. Okay, they just need to remove free block from the game. Did you see that? They like they actually have to get rid of it. I swear, that should not happen. I almost didn't get the kill because of that. <laughs> Holy shit! That is very unbalanced. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, that's all I, That's the exact reason why I really is picker ban right now. I swear, dude, I just gotta start fucking locking in town. I really, uh, every single game. That's just free win. Oh. 
I actually live. Holy fuck. What? That was so badly played by me. But fucking Nunu has Guardian. <laughs> Can we even get this? No, they're bot lanes. <laughs> what? I, I don't... This game is just so unfair. For everyone, what the hell? I had no idea Nunu had Guardian. I had no idea it was gonna shield me for... 200 almost. Oh, well, see, like, that's what I'm saying. Why don't they just go in? <laughs> like, what? I kill everyone. Oh, I hate my life. All right. All right. I couldn't ult the uh, Ash there, sadly. I'm not chasing here. Camille, by the way. <laughs> wow, look, she has 2k health and she's one-shotting people with true damage. Wait, look at this. Oh, and, and she has a gap closer that gives CC. Oh, oh, she's, is she gonna use it? Oh, look, she used it. <laughs> oh, that's fun. I feel like I should go QSS because he's a smart ADC. So as soon as he sees me jump onto something, he's gonna ult. And I don't think I can survive the burst from his team with just like Merc Tries or something. But I already have Sorx anyways, so... I also can't really trust my Morgana to shield me. He's not playing too hot. Why isn't Death Dance an item for Kaz as well? I mean, let's see. Hold on, I'm actually not sure. 80, 80 damage, 10% CBR. Because uh, it, it, you heal for physical damage. That's probably the main reason. Physical damage. Kat doesn't really do physical damage. Like, yeah, she has AD scaling, but everything's match damage in her kit, besides her autos. Yeah, but Gunblade heals off of everything. Oh. Oh. I thought we were going in, honestly. That engaged, though. Camille, <laughs> Yeah, I actually swear, Camille's probably the most broken top laner in the game. More broken than Renekton. And Jace, combined. No joke. I actually think that. They, she needs a nerf. No champion should have that good of an early game, and then also one-shot everything mid-late game. Like, a, literally everything. Banner isn't broken after the fix, but it's still annoying if, like, three people have it. So that's three minions in a wave that take 40% damage reduction, right? That's pretty annoying, but it's manageable now. At least it's not 70% with like four banners on a team. Definitely a lot better than it was. Oh, all right. I can't really assassin anyone. The assassins aren't champions anymore. TF is the best assassin. That's actually not even true, dude. Talon's the best one in the game at the moment. If you're, if you're playing Assassins, then if you're not playing Talon when he's unbanned, you're just, you're very fucking stupid. There's no point, there's no reason to not play Talon right now. I, I don't even know why he, well, I always knew he was insanely broken, but like, now people are finally realizing it. I don't know. Like, they didn't really buff anything about his damage. His damage has always been the same, but now people are finally realizing, oh, he shouldn't be able to one-shot with two long swords. When he's six. And by one shot, I mean like the no counterplay one shot. Like the WRQ auto one shot with Ignite. He buffed his Q though? Yeah, slightly. But his passive damage is like 200 early on. It's so stupid. No, it's like 150 at like level six, I think, when you have double long sword. It's insane. Talon can actually level two cheesy as well. If, if you get hit by both of his Ws, like, uh, the initial cast and the return and then an auto queue. You actually just die to him. Level two. I just don't do damage to anyone. It's so funny.
Central.